Hello, my name is Joanne Kevill. I'm Deputy Headmistress at Queen's. Um, and I'm going to talk a little bit about our curriculum. Now, we uh, welcome girls from a broad range of primary schools, um, as well as our year six moving up from lower school. And they settle in here very quickly. Um, we have small class sizes, so that means that nobody's lost in the classroom and everybody's voice is heard. Uh, we also have a house system, uh, which is led by the sixth form girls and um, has representation in every year group. So very quickly, year seven, become part of the school and they get to know the older girls as well. Um, we also have a huge range of extra curricular activities, again often led by the girls themselves and there really is something for everybody. Because our students travel from quite a large uh, distance uh, we have an extended lunch time and a lot of the clubs will happen within the lunch within the school day um, so there really is a lot a lot on offer. We are a small school and there's a real friendly family feel and you know everybody's voice is heard so with regards to clubs for example if there's a club that you'd like to do and we don't do it, tell us and the chances are we, we can make that happen as well. So that's really nice. We are an academic school and our A-level and GCSE results, well, they speak for themselves. We're one of the highest performing girls schools in the local area. We also add significant value. So value added is very strong and that's something that's very close to my heart. We offer a lot of support um, for those students who need it, whether that be one-to-one -one, um, at lunchtime or the academic clinics or specific learning support. Um, we also, um, with regards to options, for example, we ask the girls what subjects they'd like to study at GCSE and A-level and we're able to build a, a timetable to, to suit those um, choices. So again, um, girls are happy in the courses they're studying. At sixth form, we've developed the Queen's School Baccalaureate, which is a curriculum model um, designed with the girls in mind and um, we consulted with parents on that as well. So all students study three or four A-levels um, as well as undertaking an extended project qualification which is an academic research project. Uh, the girls get to choose the topic they'd like to research. Uh, they also complete um, a number of MOOCs which are massive open online courses and again they have the choice to really investigate the area that fascinates them most. And we have a quest programme so every Wednesday the afternoon um, students can sign up to competitive sports or fitness and well-being activities. We take girls ice skating and rock climbing, we do karate and yoga and they also have the opportunity to volunteer in the local community as well. Every girl in sixth form has the opportunity to take on a leadership role and um, we see this as very important so that they're able to develop and lead those skills uh, needed for the next stage in their career. We're able to adapt to the needs of every individual so if a student shows um, a real flair for a particular subject for example we're able to link into our alumni network and set up you know industry mentors um, we're able to allow them to access our academic lecture program um, or work with them to develop a curriculum and a program that suits their needs whether that be early entry to GCSE or A level or some other support that will really allow them to flourish um, and excel academically and with our careers department um, Mrs Dawson is able to offer one-to-one -one careers interviews which begin actually in year seven you know in order to help the girls figure out where they want to go and what they want to do so we can have that bespoke approach. I mentioned the family feel to the school it's a very empowering environment it's one where every voice is heard and you really can make a difference so it's a lovely place to study and I have to say it's a lovely place to work as well.